Hey Mo here with Hot Jet. How you doing? I want to go over our uh, new 2020 models. Uh, this turned into one of our best sellers. Uh, kind of describe where it fits in the market. You got your low enders. Then you got us. We're the good guys. Then you got the outrageous guys. We can build the outrageous ones if you want them. We got them, the big diesels. We like Kubota and we've recently secured a deal with Yanmar which is John Deere, she got service everywhere on the planet. So we do have those, but this fits right in the nice power curve. It's 12 gallons a minute at 4,000 PSI. It's just under the smaller, the 50 horse diesels. So it's 37 horsepower fuel injected Toyota engine. Let's take a quick walk around. Hopefully the guys will be quiet in the shop. We're just getting ready to load these out. Probably easier to go around this one. So these we can build on either our standard tandem axle trailer or this custom single axle. We're, I really like this. If you're in a small city or not going to drive too much, or if you're going to drive with water, we can do a smaller tank. But we can either do this in a 200 gallon tank or a 330 gallon tank. Got a can on my fingers at my age. <laughs> okay, so we can put a D-ring on here. This is also adjustable. We just got this wrapped up because we're getting ready to load this out. Both these out. We got the heavy, heavy duty ram crank on there. Toolbox in the front. Yeah, full stainless. The stainless guards are extra, but we this customer wanted some stainless guards. Uh, you got access right here uh, to the front of the engine, which you don't really need. It just shows an hour meter. You can kind of zoom in on that a little bit there, Borden. full exhaust nice and quiet this engine runs really nice and quiet we've gone with the German pump on these units so it has the larger cylinders for high hour output we also double feed it so you got your pulsation valve right here come on up in here and we'll show the filter gauges that's a head of pump gauge we also got a gauge in the back now what's unique about this unit of course is hot water it's integrated. It's not an add-on. It's not an afterthought. So it's been super, super, super reliable. Three supers. You've also got super access if you do have problems. We recently had one of the big brands in just yesterday. What a nightmare to work on. To get to the starter, you've got to pull the oil pan to get up into a Hots diesel. I mean, God bless Hots and a great German deal, great German motor. But these units, you can just pull the panel off and you get right at the engine. If you've got to get to the belts, a couple of bolts, you can get at it. I mean, serviceability is what it's all about. So this is a, a walk around overview video. Got to remember what I'm doing. Detergent tank. We can easily put an antifreeze tank here. This gentleman didn't want them on his units. Uh, big custom toolboxes. I really love these guys coming out of Arkansas. Just the best toolboxes made. We've had zero fell and thousands of them. Uh, good U.S. product. Our trailers are made in the U.S. The steel's U.S. I went to our trailer manufacturer, verified that it's U.S. I don't know if the mags or the tires are U.S., but the Toyota engine's made in Georgia. So we got a German pump, U.S. steel, U.S. trailer, U.S. toolboxes. That's pretty good. I've been pushing that since the 80s, since I got out of college. Learned about economics. <laughs> I think I cheated on some of my tests. So. No, that one I didn't have to. All right, hydraulically driven hose reel. I only see these on units that are 50, 60, 70,000. We've incorporated a hydraulic drive system in the mid-range price point. What a beautiful system. You can, you can go in or out with micro precision. I like that. Write that one down. Micro precision. So you can clean on the way back. After you put your nozzle out in the pipe, you can clean back. It won't over rev, say our electric motor. I still love our electric motors. Depends on the price point you're at. Okay. We've got 4,000 PSI half inch hose here, 300 feet. It's got your leader hose. It's also got your stinger, warthog. Follow safety precautions that we have with this burner off and on 
sen uh, electronic sensor will tell you the temperature, hour meter, remote switch if you're going to run the remote, lights. So it's got a 12 inch bar here. We also got a little light here. You might say, well, that one's in the way or in your eyes. Look at that. These guys think of everything. You've also got a, a recirc system. So this will re, recirc the water between jobs if you want. So you can undo right here. Screw that in there. Leave it running between jobs if you want. I like this guide arm hose reel. I have people tell me, oh, you got to have a lazy Susan. I said, well, mm, why you want all those maintenance problems? Here you just got a spring and a pin. And this is a heavy duty reel. That's quarter inch steel. I mean, that's, you know, that's, that's what you want. You, you know, we try to build them the best so your gorillas don't tear them apart, but you never know, right? Easy on off on all the reels. Throttles back here. All your controls are back here. You don't have to go up and choke the engine. That's another advantage to fuel injection. If you're higher elevation or want extra power, you want a fuel injected motor or go with turbo diesel. But again, like some of the videos I've said, that you know, diesels are great, but man, are they, they're a lot of maintenance. When they're running, they're great, but when they break, oh my gosh, it's a lot of work. Uh, Kubota's great. Of course, Yamar's great. That's why we've got those in our big diesels. So this is more of a precision tool to do residential and medium-sized commercial jobs. That's what this is designed for. Hot water, obviously, is the great equalizer. And, you know, we're going to take that to our grave and, heck, I can imagine a restaurant cleaning with cold water. I mean, come on. You know, anywhere there's grease, you need hot water. All right, this is for your wash-down hose or to run to your jumper reel, which we're going to run in this video. Let's see if we've got a jumper reel here. We also got all the overviews here and safety. So this is a jumper reel, has quarter inch steel braided hose. Kind of go in on that a little bit. And then that's foot controlled. Where did I set the foot control bar? Oh, okay. I'm gonna grab it. Here, I'll bring it right over. So depending on the package, you know, all this is included. This is the quarter inch that's the eighth inch jet line, that's the quarter inch. And then inside the toolbox, you got safety material, wart hog, two remotes. You can kind of take a look at that. It's really simple. Simon, we're gonna run this in a minute. Again, this is an overview. I don't like to go too long-winded, which I do. Fill hose, jetter hose, clean hose, or power wash hose. Hook this to your gun and you can power wash. Now again, you can go a 200 gallon tank if your rigs are a little smaller. Seems like that's hitting in kind of a sweet spot. I got this cool voice now for wearing a mask. Gotta wear a mask, man. Well, what do I look like I got some? Yeah, you gotta wear a mask. Well, okay. <laughs> well, I just wanna buy something. All right, masks are optional here. All right, so, um, you can put the 330, 330 gallon tank on this, no problem, or the 200. So take a look at this, how compact this trailer is. 10 foot, right? Yeah. I mean, that's a lot of trailer, but you can work on it. I look at these other ones, how you can work on them? I mean, you can get right at the water, water valves right there. You can get right at everything. Uh, look at these, you know, they're eight lug, 7k axles so you know no problem hauling the weight so if you're not going to travel a whole lot single axle is just fine i think that's my opinion of it and then the other option of course is you can get your color of trailer you can get red blue black green yellow this is our uh, seven up colors <laughs> call anytime we're always happy to help if you need a quote or a bid, these are great for city, county, smaller cities, municipals, school districts, uh, and a kind of a specialty tool for the router and the plumber guys. Take care, thanks.